Hello everyone, welcome back to Calico Barrows here. So last episode we were trying to find a lot of the animals, which we actually did. We're about to bring this dog to who? Gabby. Oh wait. Why are you so large? <laughs> you are a really big fox. Um and then find an Arctic fox in the mountains. Is it wait? Oh, Fox is following me. No, I told him to go to the cafe, but we need a fox to follow. So we need to go into... No. How do I do that again? This. Okay. So we need... Uh... We'll have Miss Kitty go to the cafe. There we go. And then you can follow me. And we are going to go to, I have to spawn my broom in I think. We are gonna go to, talk to Autumn first. She's just right up here. We need to talk to Blossom. I do that again. <coughs> I always do that. Go back up. Yeah, something's like in my throat. Gross. Can we go up? Uh, there we go. Hi. Have you made it to the mountains and back? How did that go? I think I might have gotten through to her. I still think the two of you should have a heart-to-heart -heart about things. And you need to reno renegotiate the discount you give her. She feels uncomfortable about it now. I told her it wasn't a big deal, but I guess I wasn't listening to her when she said it mattered to her. Thanks, Traveler. I'll take my potions up there myself next time. Okay. So wait, did she just give us a potion? Uh, mm, change animal... No. I don't know. I thought she did, but maybe not. Oh, it's probably a, uh... Thing like that. Do you need anything else? I've invented what I think to be the most magically tasty cat treats ever, but I need a real cat to test them out on. Perfect, this cat will do wonderfully. Here you go. Please try out Auntie Autumn's magically delicious treats. Oh, I think I might have made a mistake in the recipe. I'll see what I can do to fix the recipe. Thanks for your help. Hmm. <laughs> it's floating! Okay, so I think we're done with you. We need to... Wait, assign the Arctic Fox to the cafe. Oh, that is right. We need to go to the cafe, put the fox back there. Oh, well, I can actually just do that through here, as we found out. So you actually are supposed to be at the cafe. Talk to Lumi. And then Blossom should be right over here. Is he gonna be like stuck like this forever or how do I fix that? There we go. Okay. <laughs> I was gonna say, I'm gonna ride on. Let's go. Blossom has her garden with. <gasps> forgot her name. Oh, wow. I forgot her name. She has blue hair. They've been together four years. Yes, her. Okay. Hi. Are you the one I was missing? I think you were. No. Okay, weird. Cause it's pink. Anyways, what is your name? Just as Bunny. Oh, whoops. Starshine, you outdid yourself. Oh, this might be even better than your aunt's. Wait, don't tell her I said that, okay? Promise? I could eat the whole batch of these. 
Not that I can think of. Not right now. Okay, so I think they might be done. Talk to... Huh? Why are there so many... What? He's fancy. He's a fancy... Where are all these coming from? Pigeon King? Did those count? No? What? Are more animals arriving now? I'm just checking through. We still need the one. Okay, yeah, weird. That is really strange. Uh, who am I? Talk to Lumi. Gabby, Black Cat. Different styles is for her, I think. Okay, so we need to go to the, um... Wintry area, talk to Lumi. I should actually see if there's more stuff to buy. More recipes, because I have a lot. Her place is right up here. Oh, actually, after I talk to Lumi, I'm going to look at that weird thing I saw last episode that was, like, around here. Okay. Is she here? I didn't actually look on my map. She's probably not here. Is she at my cafe? Oh, no, she, she is. I saw that cute little fox in the cafe the other day. You know, regardless of what impression she makes on the other customers, it made me feel like I was at home to come down the mountain and see a snow animal there. I'll definitely be coming back to visit again soon. Did my money go down? Oh, when they... Wait. I don't know. Um, let's look at more requests. Talk to Safina. Oh. Start or stop snow. That's cool. We are going to... Oh, there we go. Oh, no. I don't know. Um, I saw the weird thing. I need my broom right here. Ow, my foot is, like, cramping up. I don't eat a lot of potassium because... I do not like bananas. I hate bananas. I don't know why. I do not like the taste. It's so strong tasting to me. Oh, because it's, like, a cat face. I guess it's... No, oh, it's the collar. Oh, that is so cute. Okay, so we need to go talk to Safina, who is in the capital. And we need to look for still two animals in the city. One animal in the heart village, which is over here, which I guess... Wait, yeah, there's just more animals nowadays? That's so interesting. She ate stale coffee. Drunk. Um, well... So we need two animals here... Also one in Golden Gr Oh, do you need anything? I haven't really did your stuff, I don't think. I still think it would help people feel at home in the cafe. Oh, that was you! Okay, I thought for some reason that was Estelle. There's way more customers! Customers? There's way more people- wait, where is she? Oh, is she in my cafe? She is. Okay, let's go to the cafe then. Yes. She's still in here? Hi. Nice to see you today. Right, and I asked, how's business? Only wait, don't answer that because I'm going to answer for you. Business is great. Here's what you made on your investments and my business cats were so happy for the support. Nothing right now. Not right now. Um, can I buy stuff for you? When my day begins with you. Um, we got everything we need. Set loose to fly around curious animals. This would be handy. Greeting. Oh! Because I still have your quest. So now we need to... Go to find a black cat in the woods at night. So we need to go to the golden. We're missing one animal there, but we also need to talk to the other mouse because she might have some quests. We haven't really talked to her, or we've only talked to her once, I think. 
We also need to keep a lookout for an animal, which is not that bear. That's a bear we've already done. I also just faced through that log. Are you Mr. Bear? Because I remember that is when I have. Hello? Yes. You are Mr. Bear. Elsa is going crazy under the room on her cat tree. You. No, you're the one I'm doing right now. But I did bring you a animal. I think this is the type of dog you wanted. Hi Gabby, how about this dog? Are you okay? Did you hurt yourself? Only my heart just broke. This dog is too cute. I love them so much. What kind of breed are they? This is a Japanese Spitz, apparently. This is the perfect doggy. Thank you so much. I'm always happy to play matchmaker. Enjoy your new friend. Okay, do you need anything else? Not right now. Okay. Let's go talk to... I've already picked you up before. Todd, yes. I don't know if I picked you up before. I think I might have, though. Come back here. I know I've definitely done the boar. Where is... And you, because you're so cute. What the? Um, how did this get on my head? I was looking at a different corner of my screen and... Um... How do I get him off? Okay, weird. <laughs> I don't see any other animals, so let's see. Do you have any quests for us? You are so cute. I was just collecting some berries. These pinkish ones are in season right now. They're bitter to eat, but good for making tea. Uh, so how's the cat cafe? Yeah, I'm sorry. I haven't come to say hello. I don't get out much. I was just thinking about how I should get out more, but I don't know. The cat cafe sounds lovely. Sometimes Zen brings me baked goods from there, and we have a picnic in the woods and share them. I'd love to come myself, but... I mean, um, no offense, but it's, um, um, cats. I wish I could get over it, but their teeth and claws so sharp, and their eyes like they're looking into another dimension. I believe you, and since I'm a mouse-based magical girl, not a real mouse. Oh. I know I'm not in danger of actually being eaten, but every time I see one, I just want to run away. I guess it's an instinct. It's pathetic, I know. Zen thinks if I just spend some more time around cats, I would get used to them, but I also don't leave the woods much and get ner kind of nervous in town. You do that? It might work. I could try it, I think. Well, um, don't mind me, but I had this group of... Aren't I missing a cat? Hi, Daisy. This is Char. Char, Daisy. Oh, gosh. Don't worry, I won't let go of them. You can just watch them for a bit. I guess they're kind of cute. Horrible, but cute? Should I try petting them? Oh gosh, oh wow, they're soft, just like me. Hey, thanks. It really helps to have someone to support me while I try to work through this. I... I think I'm going to try coming to the cafe sometime. Thanks again. Here, take this. It's just some things I've collected that I don't need. Bye, Char! Do you have anything else? I wanted to thank you again for helping me see that cats aren't as scary as I thought. I'm still a bit scared, but come to Cat Cafe, lots of cats. I still get nervous around more than one cat at a time. Cutie City. Go to Gabby. He lives around here. And we ran into each other in town. He offered to show me around the city. I told him I wasn't sure I wanted to go, but now I'm ready. The only problem is I haven't seen him in a while. Oh, wait. Isn't Gabby the one right over here, right? The deer? Meanwhile, I know I picked up this dog before. Hey, come back here. Um, isn't it right up here? I could be wrong. Is this Gabby? Jump, jump, jump. I think it is. Gabby, is this you? Yeah. 
You offered to show Daisy around Cutie City? Yeah, she said she was curious about the city, so I offered to give her a tour sometime. She seemed pretty nervous about it. I guess she doesn't leave the woods very often, so a city is a lot for her. Oh, that's great. I'll stop by your house tomorrow. Will you let her know? Alright, let me go. I hear birds. Next time, I'm going to have to write down every single animal I have, don't I? To try to find out. Otherwise, I'm going to just keep picking up the same ones. Well, eventually... Yeah, she's over here. I should have them memorized, but... I don't yet. I'm sure there hasn't been any, like... Chipmunks or, like, rodents, really. Like, there's the bice. Oh, there's rabbits, I guess. So why am I going to her door? Good day. You talk to Gabby? He said he stopped by tomorrow to bring to Cutie City. Oh gosh, okay, it's happening. I'll get ready. Thank you so much for finding him for me. Please take this recipe. Cinnamon rolls are my favorite, but I'm not actually very good at baking. I bet yours will be amazing. All right, so I think we're good here. We should, I need to go to the town. Um, the mountains, I know we're done. The city, we're still missing two. The coast, we got all. Oh, we got it. It was the deer, I think. I'm pretty sure it was the deer. Okay, so let me actually... Oh, I already closed my notebook. <laughs> uh, so we just need three animals, right? Two cutie city and then one at Heart Village. Okay, three animals. That's not too shabby. Okay, let's go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm gonna go buy a lot of stuff because I have a lot of money. Is this even the way? Yeah, I think so. This island is shaped like a star, which is very neat. Oh, I should see if you need anything. Hi, do you need anything? Hello? It's nice that you come all the way out here to my lighthouse once in a while, friend. I don't get too many visitors out here. That's fine with me, though. I like spending time with myself. Really? It's the best, isn't it? I was so excited to take over the job of lighthouse keeper. I need my alone time, so it's perfect for me. If I get lonely, I go visit town. Sometimes I see Poppy walking along the beach from my lighthouse, too, and just seeing him there makes me feel kind of like we're hanging out. You know, though, if you're the cat cafe owner, you must be really good with the animals, right? Another person living here would be too much, but having an animal living with me might be just the right amount of interaction. I should start simple though, because I haven't taken care of a pet before. What do you think is a good first pet? A cat! That sounds perfect. Oh, but I don't know where to find one. Wait, you're the animal person, right? Do you think you could bring me a new friend? Wow, I can't wait. Um, yes, and actually I can take, because these are my babies. Um... We have Chompy, Miss Kitty, who I love, Tiny, Calico, maybe Rusty, but let's see some others. Ooh, we, oh, we should do a funny one. Let's see if there's any, these are, oh, I forgot there was that. So there has been rodents, Never mind. <gasps> this one's cute, this seems perfect. Or this one? Snuggly. Penny sounds cute. Penny's the name of the cat I've watched on um Instagram. And it's so cute because I like, got human voices over it, but it's adorable. Hi, there you are. You're so small. Oh my gosh, and your hair matches. That's adorable. Oh my gosh, they are so adorable. Hello, new friend. Are you going to keep me company out here at my lighthouse? Oh, thank you so much, you animal whisperer. I'll have to bring my new friend by the cafe sometime to play with the other animals. Not today. Hmm. We got a new cat at home. That would be a fun game. I mean, kind of like this is. <laughs> like, picking, like being a pet shop owner. But pet shops are not that great. But, like, I guess rescue and helping people get, like, their dream animals. Okay, let's see if you need anything. Nope. Okay. 
We're still missing two animals here. Where do you think they could be? We've definitely done the goat and the raccoon. Hmm. It might be like blending in with all these cats. I don't know. That might be a time where I might have to like spend time looking. But right now we're going to actually head back to the city. Because I need to buy different chair styles. Or at least place. I might have more now. Every time a cat spawns in, I'm just like, whoa. You can normally sell stuff. Hi. Meow. Okay. That's a different type of chair. Sloth toy. Oh, bread. Okay. Oh, hair tie for toys. That's funny. Can I actually talk to you, though? Yeah. Um. Okay. I can't. Do you need anything? Oh, okay. Oh, it's just been one heck of a morning. I was juggling a box of accessories, a muffin, and my store keys at the door when I was sworn by some pigeons. I guess they wanted my cupcake more than I did. I was so surprised that I tossed everything up into the air. When everything came down, I realized that I lost most of what I've been holding. My cupcake gone. Half the accessories adorning the pigeons now. Ah! Also, my store keys are gone. I think they were stuck to one of the pigeons along with the accessories. Could you be a pal and go and look for those pigeons? Okay. I definitely know where they are. They're all roaming around. Like, look at him! He thinks he owns the place! Um, no, that's not what I want. I'm trying to pick him up. Oh no. Okay, let's wait for him to come out. Hey! Not you! Not you! Oh my goodness. <laughs> Drop! Drop! I've been pressing X. I was like, am I pressing the wrong button? Okay, so... Pick up the dap... And check for the keys. Oh, I see. That's not what I wanted. I don't know what I just did. Oh. I teleported back here. Anyways, I think we can put down another chair. Okay. Inventory. Every day is something new. That's not a chair. There we go. Top to Zen. Okay, meanwhile, we're going to head back to the town to buy stuff and look for the pigeons. What animal do you think I'm missing around here? I picked him up before, right? Yes. We got boots, pudgeons. Okay. Oh, it's already getting dark. Did I get the potion for it to be morning? Okay. I've already picked up you a lot. Wanna buy some stuff? No other recipes? Huh. I wonder if I have all the recipes then. Not you. It's probably just gonna be the last one, right? So I need one more. Where is he? Oh, you look so cool right now. Hmm. Where is he? Where is he? he it's not you. 
Pigeon King. Fashionable. Fancy. Over here, I don't see. Oh, there's one all the way up there. Maybe this one. Queen, there she is. Okay, and talk to Maribel. How'd it go? Maybe you should start selling accessories to pigeons. They seem to love them. As clean as that sounds, I've had it with those birds for today. Were you able to get my store key back? Thanks for finding that for me. Here I was, worried I was going to need to get a whole new set of keys and change my lock. You're a lifesaver. Here, I've got a little something for you. Oh yeah, I did actually want to buy some short, or I mean a skirt, if you have a skirt. Ooh. Let's change our bottoms. What color? Sure, I guess. Okay. We need to go to the Witchy Woods. Let's go. We need to go there when it's nighttime and play with a cat there. Are the. I just realized the clouds are like animals. Like that's a cat, like laying upside down. Or maybe I'm just crazy. Okay, so it said to play with a cat, a black cat in the woods at night. You're a black cat, I think. No, you are a spotty cat. Find a black cat. I have to find it. I think that's why. So, Char. And then... No? Find a black cat in the woods at night. I'm gonna look that up really quick, I guess, because I don't know how to, else to do it. So hold on. Okay, I did it. I just had a look on the animal menu and I looked for what cats are in the witching woods specifically and I forgot about Unfamiliar was here. So I just called it to follow me and then I played with the cat toy. <laughs> it took a little bit. Okay, now we can go talk to, back to Rosa. Glad she's not asleep yet. <laughs> These people like to stay up late. Hey, you found the cat, didn't you? I totally felt a shift in the forest's energy the other night. Did you feel it too? Hmm, you look unsure. It's okay, you'll get more attuned to it if you keep practicing. Let me know if you ever want to learn another ceremony. Oh, and take this. It's one of my favorite toys to use for the cats in the woods. You should have it in case you find more cats to play with. Wait, are you here because you want to learn some more witch's magic? Honor and protect the flying creatures of the woods. Cultivating a good relationship with the creatures of the air is very important for witches. Especially if you intend to use a broomstick one day. I already have a broom. The Owl Club girls help me out with this one sometimes, but they all seem quite busy today, so I didn't like to bother them. Would you like to help? I need one feather from each type of birds that live in these woods. Daisy, you know, the little mouse girl who lives near here? She's always collecting things of that sort and has never failed to have the feathers I need. If you could go pick up those ingredients from her, I could get everything else ready in the meantime. Alright, sounds good to me. Do we have the potion to turn it into daytime? Oh, I do not. Oh, yes I do. There we go! It's a new day! 
it just magically happens. So she's in the, over here. My stomach is growling. I'm about to eat dinner. <laughs> Golden Grove is over here. Yes. And where exactly am I in relation? Uh, oh, here she is. There she is. Feathers for Rosa's ceremony? I have just the things. Are you learning witch's magic from Rosa? That's really cool. She knows a lot, probably more than anyone else in the woods, about traditional magic at least. Here you go, have fun. Thank you. Okay, talk to Zen. Where is Zen again? Okay, let's go talk to her, because we're actually, well, we're like even distance, I feel like. Actually, no, we were closer to Rosa, because the... She's in the city, not the beach area. You cannot leave the map. Okay, let's see. Oh, there's an orange leaf here. You're not allowed here. That was adorable. Okay. Let us see. I should have checked. I should always check to see if they actually are here. Otherwise, I just came here for no reason. Yes, there she is. You got the chairs? That's great. I can't wait to try them out and find my favorite comfy place. Oh, infinite chairs. I need your help. I'm starting to panic. It's my new pet ferret, Mr. Snuggles. He's gone missing. Oh, I've actually seen him. He tends to run off and find places to hide and sleep, but he usually comes right back after his nap. I remember him playing around with Rosa at her house in the woods. You don't think that he got lost in the woods? Wait, the ferret? Whoops. Um... Uh, isn't he? Oh, that's Kovu. So he's in the woods? I don't see anyone for that. have. Is he at my cafe? Hmm. I mean, we have to go to Rose anyway, so let's go. And that will be the last thing for this video. This game actually does have quite a lot. I really like it. I'm coming back to you, Rosa. I'm only missing three animals. I don't know how many recipes I'm making. Oh, I still have to cook those. I should have cooked those. Yeah, I'll cook them next time. Uh, wait. Okay. I need to go this way. Yes. This would be correct. Also, it looked like she was walking, so please don't go that far. So do they go to my cafe? Like, they walk all the way there. They don't, like, just spawn there. Like, they're... So you can walk with them to the cafe, or... Oh, she's gone. I think she is going to my cafe. Okay. Let's go. Oh, she's going with her sister. Talk to Rosa. I'm trying. Oh, wonderful. You got them. These are perfect. Okay, I've gathered all the rest of the ingredients. So the next step is to mix them all together in a witch's cauldron. Always stir gently and with intention. Your emotions will make their way into the mixture, so it's important to maintain a positive attitude. 
While stirring, you speak a magical blessing for the birds to imbue the potion with intention. It doesn't matter so much what the actual words are of the blessing, just the intention. I like to say, may your wings be strong and the wind carry you far. Why don't you try it? Just say whatever comes to you. Yeah, that'll work. So, now it actually takes quite a while for the potion to be ready, and after that, I still have to bring it to the middle of the woods. I don't want to keep you all day. I'm sure you got other things to do, but you already helped a lot. Thank you so much. Um, about that, I actually have some more I need to talk to you about. Oh no, Mr. Snuggles is missing? Zen thinks she saw him last around your house. Have you seen him? Not since Zen was here. But now that you mention it, I remember seeing Mr. Snuggles playing around with her hat. Yep, I'm betting that he's probably under her hat asleep on her head. Mr. Snugglesworth is a very sound sleeper. Just head back to Zen and I'm sure everything will be fine. Oh. Okay, do you need anything else? Nothing at the moment. Okay, so did I get... No. What does this do? I haven't used this. That is a cute outfit! Okay, I'm gonna talk to Zen. I know I was like, oh, I'm about to... Get off, but let me talk to Zen, finish that mission, and then we'll be done. <laughs> I'm going that way. I think it's right over here. Or not. Yes, it is. So, I think you eat still stuff. <laughs> Sorry, I haven't really been... It is funny, this is a game about managing your cat cafe, but I haven't really been doing that. I don't know, growing up, I used to love decorating games, like decorating the house and stuff, but now, I don't know. I'm just not about that anymore, I guess. Yay. You're back, but I don't see Mr. Snuggles. Oh no, he's still lost, isn't he? Is what? Oh no, not again. Under my hat? And you want me to look under it? Right now? Okay, but you have to close your eyes. I don't want to show off my hat hair. Huh. That was cool. My gosh, I'm so embarrassed, but I guess I'm more happy that he's safe. I can't thank you enough. Wait, 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 wait. So are you actually one of the animals? Oh, you were! So some of them, I guess, can't be unlocked till you solve quests? Okay, so now we only need two animals. And that was all the quests we, we have, right? Yeah. All right, so that's gonna do it for this episode. And I will see you guys in the next one. Goodbye, everyone.